my friends welcome back to a new video my name is janet if you've never been here before hello welcome um please consider subscribing it will really mean a lot to me um today um I actually woke up early not like yesterday that i woke up at freaking almost 1 p.m um today is 10 08 i already got ready i'm going to santa monica with my sisters to run some errands um and then when i come back um I do want to get started with the like getting the names for the secret santa because i don't want a last minute christmas shop because that's super stressful so i just want to see who we got and get started on the christmas shopping so yeah right now i'm gonna go to santa monica and i'll be right back bye guys hey my friends so our errand here in Santa Monica, my sister's actually getting her mole removed. She has a mole on top of her lip. Um, I try to convince her not to because I like it, but you know, everybody's different and she does not feel comfortable with it. She says it's grown, right? Over yeah. like the years and stuff. So she- and With sun exposure and stuff. With sun exposure and stuff. So we're here in Santa Monica trying to get it removed. And yeah, hopefully it goes good. Today's just a consultation. It's not the actual procedure, um, but hopefully everything goes good. Okay, this just took a turn. <laughs> this just took a turn. Um, I thought we were just here for the consultation, but they actually told Josie that she could come and do the procedure right now. Um, so she, of course, it depends on person to person, but her total is right now four hundred dollars. So I think it's reasonable. She already knew what she was messing with. Um, so are you gonna I do it? Up. Yeah, she saved up for a while. She did her research. Um, for, for this place for a year, so I think she's pretty safe and she's being responsible. So are you ready? Yeah. You gonna do it? I think, yeah. <gasps> she's gonna do it right now. So goodbye, Mo. Beauty mark. Oh. Beauty mark. What's the difference? Mo just seems so like. Oh, like you don't like it? Oh, so beauty mark. Goodbye, beauty mark. because she's been wanting this for a very long time good job okay guys um something we didn't mention is they are sending her beauty mark over to ucla medical center i believe because lee said that any tissue they remove from your skin from your face that they have to check it to make sure it's not cancerous um you know, hopefully todo sale bien, but they're gonna give her a call. And she said that like, especially with uh, beauty marks or moles, whatever you guys wanna call it, um, you just have to be careful because if there's any like, like weird growth or like it changes colors, that's when you should be worried. I did mention that, uh, um, oh my God, I'm out of breath. I'm so out of shape, yo. I did mention that hers has grown through the years, but she said that that actually does happen too, just because, you know, you're getting older and she's always had it since she was younger. No. Nobody. You didn't? No, and I've seen pictures. And I had it until, I think, third grade, I started growing. Careful. Go, go, go. Wait, so you never, you, didn't, you didn't have it when you were little? I did not have it when I was a baby. I did not have it when I was in kinder. I did not have it. I only had like a little dot. Well, this is no, 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 I've had it in, I think, second grade, or, I don't know, we'll get, but, Pero it, was no just lunar little, at all? it was just a lunar, like, okay, a, a okay, small but that's one, a lunar, then. but when I was a baby, my mom said she, I didn't have one at all, oh, so it just kind of grew, it kind of grew, yeah, 
So literally from the get go, they were super nice. How'd you see? Yes, I was nervous and I don't, I don't really like talking to people. Like I do like talking. No, I don't. <laughs> what do you call? I get very shy and get. It's because she's more seria, huh? You're more seria. Yeah. Like not seria, like in a mean way, but she's just more quiet, more to herself. I'm the like the extrovert and she's more introvert that's why she brought me i brought her yeah, yeah. because and then the lady's all like oh like who is she she's so protective <laughs> but you know i don't know if you guys know we are six years apart so definitely i'm gonna be protective even though i'm the freaking shortest one from my sisters but yeah you see i'm proud of you thank you okay guys so now we're just gonna head home hopefully there's no traffic and i'll see you guys when i'm home Bye. okay my friends so we just made it home um just in case you were wondering what my parents thought about my sister's um like mole remover removing procedure um so my parents are old school mexicans so they don't really agree with any like cosmetic procedures if that's what you want to call it um but however there was a situation where my sister's mole started to bleed and that's kind of when we realized that some moles may be cancerous so you know especially my mom she was kind of like you know what, whatever get it removed if you know she just cares about her well-being um so she was cool with it everybody was cool with it um also for me what i realized today is that i didn't realize how much it meant for my sister to get it removed because she started getting teary i had like i would always be like dude why are you gonna remove it like for what for what for what for what and you know people have different insecurities and just because i liked it did not mean that she liked it so it definitely made me see how much it meant for her um but yeah guys i am gonna leave the information to the clinic we went to um down in the description box below just in case you guys want to get um any moles removed um yeah. i know but his churros are specifically de yawalika then why was everybody talking about yawalika in the comments that's what i'm saying okay guys so my mom and my sister are trying to make churros from well my mom's my mom's from a ranchito near Yawalica. It's Yawalica's in Jalisco. Um and when I used to go to the parties, they have these churros that aren't really like it looks more like a bread, but they call it churros. And inside they put cajeta, which is churros gordos. It's gruesos, yeah. Oh, gruesos. So, well they consider churros gruesos. Um and ma, how do you say cajeta in English? Cajeta. Cajeta. <laughs> so it has cajeta <laughs> just kidding um it's kind of like i don't know what to, i don't know how to explain what cajeta means in english but i guess like like a caramel sauce i don't know um if you guys know what it means just comment down below um but they're trying to recreate it right now and my mom is masando la like la masa so hopefully they come out and actually there's a tiktok of this place in anaheim that had him and in the comments, I was like, oh my god, the churros from Yawalika. In the comments, everybody was putting like, Yawalika, Yawalika, Yawalika. And I got all excited. But yeah, guys, so let's see how they come out. I can't have any because I'm on keto, but I just want to see if they at least look like it. <laughs> but we'll see. This one's my little bud that's always at my mom's house because he doesn't like me and my boyfriend. But you're still our kid, you know that, right? I just want you to know that you're still our kid. And I love you even though you don't love me. <laughs> Santa is today but unfortunately um our ink mm, not given so i have to write everything um we have all the people here that are included basically just like our close family and um we put five things that we would like on our wish list so the person and we included sizes colors everything but okay like you know whoever gets whoever doesn't get confused on what to get so i'm gonna go ahead and write everything down and let's do it Okay, friends, 
So I already got, I already got my Secret Santa. I'm actually very excited. Um, but yeah, guys, I can't tell you guys, and we're gonna definitely go Christmas shopping soon. And let's just say, I'm gonna get a fire ass gift. Me too, me too. Okay, I get nice gifts because I love to give, okay? Um, but yeah, guys, this is going to be the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, please don't forget um, to subscribe if you haven't. Give this video a like, leave me a nice comment, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye!